Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the Peak Minute. I'm Jordan with Everest Laboratories. Today, we're going to talk a little bit about how diluting out a specimen with water, your urine specimen before a drug screen, um, is caught by the lab and kind of why this really won't work. Uh, the, the two ways, obviously, are going to be adding water directly to your urine or drinking a bunch of water before the test if you know the testing day. Uh, the first one, if you add water to the sample, one, there, there's a lot of, at the collection facilities, there's a lot of precautions they take in the bathroom where you collect your sample. Usually they shut off the sink so you can't get water there and then they'll put blue dye in the toilet. So you try and use that water and put it in with your urine and obviously your sample's gonna look blue. Uh, the, the collector is gonna know that you tampered with it and it's gonna be a, a failed drug screen. Uh, on top of that, the actual adding of water is really gonna dilute it up and when you get the test done, it's gonna show up. Uh, the second one, if you drink a bunch of water beforehand, let's say, you actually know the testing date, which is one step that you have to know. Pre-employment, maybe you know, but if it's a random or reasonable suspicion or post-accident test, you're not going to know the date and not going to know to drink a bunch of water beforehand. So that's going to be the first problem. Second, if you drink a lot of water when it gets to the lab and gets tested for it, they use two um, additional tests to basically determine is this actual urine. The first one is the creatinine test and the second one is specific gravity. And basically what it is is determining the specific gravity determines is the density of your urine too close to water, in which case it's dilute. And same with creatinine, which is a, a waste product that your body gets rid of through urine. If it, there's not enough of that um, basically coming out in your urine, it's too low, they're going to know that you drank water to try and lower that. And again, um, it can be intentional or unintentional, but it's still going to come back as a dilute specimen. So that's something to be aware of as an employer or just if you're getting a, a drug test on your own. So. Hopefully you guys like this info. Thanks.